think you turned it on when it's a prank. No. Yeah, did you prank me? No. Are you gonna get the shoes too, Trace? Shoes. You wanna get some shoes? Shoes. Yeah, why don't we look at some shoes for you, big guy? Shoes. Look at these ones over here. Look at these shoes right here. Cat. Cat. Oh, you like the cat? Cat. You get new shoes? Monkeys. Did you pick some new shoes? Yep, foxes. Foxes. Let's go. We just got done buying Cheyenne a new pair of shoes. She grew out of her shoes in one week. Like the first, the beginning of the week, I noticed her toes were cramped up at the edge. And um, by the end of the week, I had gone through all her shoes and none of them fit her anymore. Is that how other people's kids grow out of their stuff? Just like you start to notice one thing doesn't fit and then all of a sudden you're like, okay, you have no more shoes left. And it randomly got rainy and the only pair she had left to wear were sandals. So we had to hurry up and get her some new shoes quickly. Michael was sweating and wondering why he's so hot right now. I in think the car. you tricked me. No, and he looks down in the seat warmer, and the seat warmer's on. He's like, why am I so hot? Why you am I sweating? Me. I think you turned it on at the prank. No. Yeah, did you prank me? No. It was so hot. It's like 100 outside. Okay, it's okay, 69, 69 degrees outside. But it feels like 80. But it feels hot, and it was like, I'm sweating in all of the region. Yummy? Mm-hmm. Yummy. Look your face, buddy. Chocolate? Yep. We've had such odd weather lately. What is it, babe? It was cold for like two days, and then now it's like 70 and nice. What is it, honey? Oh, is that one yucky? Here, let's see. Mira means yucky. Mira means look. But it's really nice now, and hanging out outside while mama gets a little break inside relaxing and taking care of Wyatt oh. I'll show you a little haul in a second I'm feeding Wyatt right now poor guy um, was hungry and cried in the car and it's so hard for me to listen to him cry in the car he's so little he's eight weeks so um, I, re I know I remember feeling like that with each of my kids when they're this little like still newborns and they start crying in the car. Um, maybe you other moms can tell me if you felt this way, but I feel like I just wanna pull the car over and jump out and grab them and you know, nurse them, change them, help them with whatever they need. And sometimes I do that. You know, I find a safe spot to pull over and nurse right there if I have to, but he was okay. We weren't far from home, so he made it home and now I'm feeding him. I remember Cheyenne not liking her car seat at all and I remember thinking like, maybe I just won't leave anywhere <laughs> because she screams in her car seat and you know, it stresses you out. I was a new mom and I, yeah, I didn't want to stress her out like that either. And I did limit how much I went out, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. And Michael had to go to work, so I had to go to the grocery store and you know, Target to get things we needed, so.
Let's go for a ride. Show me how you ride. Hi. Yeah, you're a good rider. I love those moments when you're out in the back and hanging out and the kids are playing by themselves and I get to watch Cheyenne ride her bike and Trace run his trike all around and chase me around on her bike. Do you guys use those bikes with the training wheels or do you use the kind that Cheyenne has where it's just a balance bike? We've heard that if you just use the balance bike, uh, you can skip the training wheel section altogether. Okay, here's a little haul of what we got at Walmart. <clears throat> So a case for this camera, oops, simple, it was only $9. These bibs for Wyatt, it's so funny because I got bibs like after each of my kids were born but I ended up donating them because I never needed them but with, for Wyatt, he's a little bit more of a drooler, spits up a little bit more. So these are the bibs I got, comes with two. I wanted to get muslin ones because I know Walmart carries muslin bibs but they didn't have any today, so I'll have to look another day. The pairs of shoes the kids picked out. Cheyenne's are little foxes, I think. Um, Trace one of the monkeys. And then socks for Wyatt, because seriously, I don't know how anyone successfully washes baby socks and keeps them. Like, I thought I was pretty good at not losing socks in the washing machine or dryer, but I have, like, three pairs, maybe four pairs of socks that just went missing. Our colander got ruined because a piece of plastic melted in the dishwasher and left a weird coating on everything in our dishwasher that was stainless steel. And I like to use a lot of stainless steel instead of plastic, so it ruined our colander. Anyway, organic pink lady apples, my favorite type of apples. Organic strawberries, two packs, because lately the kids have just been going through these literally like in a day. Um, blueberries, and then this was pretty neat. I always try to buy the less, you know, um, I don't know, I guess not toxic, that seems kind of too strong a word, but you know, the cleanest toothpaste I can find. And I found this brand called Hello, and they actually had an organic one, but it was a little bit more expensive, and I thought we'd just kind of go with a bargain this time. This one's fluoride-free, and then no artificial sweeteners, no dyes. So that's at Walmart. And then two boxes of diapers, one for each of my little guys. Normally I cloth diaper, but you know, in this season where we have an eight week old and two other kids, I try to give myself some grace and I buy disposables just to lighten the load a little bit. And I know, you know, eventually I'll be able to get back into cloth diapering and save money and resources too, but right now we just need to do disposables and that's okay. You saying hi? Hi. Hi, Wyatt. Running, you're moving your legs around. Are you running around? Trying to run? Why is he running? He's not running. What? He can't run yet. You're so cute. Walk around with that a little bit more. Can you walk? What are you doing with that thing on your foot? What is that on your foot? You got that on your foot? Uh oh. Whoa! Kimmer. You're crazy. Kimmer. Kimmer. Say hi. Hi. Gouch. 
Look right here. Say hello. Look. Right here. Hello. 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 I love you. Hello. She's supposed to be in bed. One second. Okay, I'm back. One of those days. At least Wyatt is asleep. All right guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the videos, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe so you can get some more.